Jack Nicklaus is the most decorated player in the history of major championship golf, with a record 18 titles to his name. In a career spanning almost 60 years, the Golden Bear has presided over some of the most memorable moments in the sport's history. To honour his life in golf, the USGA have opened a room dedicated to his career at their museum in Far Hills, New Jersey, something Jack was honoured to receive. You don't, you don't really dominate the game of golf. The game of golf, you, I think you earn most of the things that you get, because if you don't do what you're supposed to do, there's always somebody right in behind you that's going, going to do what they have to do. That's the beauty of the game. That's the competition you have in the game is with yourself. And how do you keep yourself uh, focused and not allow, not allow yourself to get caught up in the moment? The Nicholas Room offers an interactive experience that will allow everyone to appreciate Jack's legacy and relive many of the greatest moments in American golf history. Among those paying tribute to Jack was Mike Davis, who emphasised his legacy in the game through playing, but also in his other ventures, such as course design. Well, Jack, first let me say what an honour it's been for us to see the Jack Nicklaus Room, which was a vision, go from a vision to a plan, from a plan to become bricks and mortar to this grand opening today. This is an occasion about a career and life that have inspired many generations of players and fans of the game. And I suspect many in this room today were inspired with, by Jack. Inside the room are items that have been collected over the years, everything from clubs to scorecards, plus some of the more memorable outfits. But one of the highlights is a specially commissioned sculpture, which captures Nicholas winning the US Open in 1980. What this has is a lot of action, which makes it larger than the four feet that it is. And um, it's, it's a iconic pose that he chose himself. I was told that he, this was his favorite photograph that he wanted to take in from. You know, when you have someone pose, you're looking, you're, try, you're trying to get something of their personality, their character in the sculpture. And he has that kind of, where he could focus on his objective and, and, and go at it, that ferocious competitiveness, but really with himself. Jack's room is the fifth at the USGA Museum alongside Bob Jones, Ben Hogan, Arnold Palmer and Mickey Wright. Humble as ever, Jack paid tribute to his family, who've played such a pivotal role in his career. Thanks for my family for being here with me, to share this with me. It's very special when you've got uh, such a supportive group. i got a bunch of great grandkids and, and a great, great bunch of kids and families and spouses and friends that uh, are here to share this with me today. So it's truly, truly very, very, very special. Thank you.